Okay, so what could possibly be in this castle? In the cemetery world. <laughs> Let's just go and find out. What the hell am I looking at? <laughs> okay. This makes like no sense. All these portraits of Yu Yu of someone must be a fan of Yu Yu Go, or this is Yu Yu Go herself that lives in this castle. It's either Yu Yu Go or a really dedicated fan. Maybe it's a super obsessed fan who wants to marry her. I don't know. <laughs> Why does it say love all over the place? I might want to actually hit that. And the music here is still glitchy. Uh oh. Alright, so we're gonna go a different way. And if we would have not hit that thing. So, how does it make a difference anyway? Just. Oh, what the fuck is going on with this background? What was going on through their heads when they made the decision to actually put this in? What were they thinking? What was going on through this person's mind when they decided this would be a good idea for their background? Yeah, because this totally makes sense. <laughs> I don't want to die here, though. Chucks and Yu Yu Go's castle, or I don't even know anymore. It's Japanese, what do you expect? I mean, this is the same country that gave us you know what. Oh, there's the boss! Is this the second half? Is only. I thought I just made the game freeze by trying to save state. I thought there was some new technology that would make the game freeze by trying to just save state. What's going on here? Hey, Yomo's just doing nothing. Just standing there with this look on her face, like I don't even know what that's supposed to be. And we have this big boot boss without a face, and all of a sudden we got these more advanced graphics for the sprites. Like, what the hell? That fight was super easy. Okay, now we're on the beach. Hey, what's going on? All of a sudden, we're just flying. Like this. Up to move up, down to move down. All of a sudden, you're just flying like this now. Like, what the hell? What's down here? So what's the point of this room, anyway? Oh, I guess that's just the power-up, if you want to. Oh, so this is the real level. I like this background, actually. I'm pretty sure he found this from somewhere, but the palettes are kind of weird. But still, this guy found a pretty awesome background. Okay, we have Lily White throwing bombs with the letter E on them. Yeah. Sprites can pass through there, but you can't. And really, that's really not the best way to represent lava coming out of a cannon. It just cuts off to nothingness. Yeah, this still this game is still as weird as ever. Bombs with letter E on them. Like, I still can't get over it. I mean that happened the first time around. Back. Oh, you can't ever end up small, so. Okay, so that star's just gonna make you have a fire flower power up or something. Really, why would I want that? Like if I could have a cape. Not a good pal on that bullet bill cannon, honestly. The whole bad pilots 
poorly drawn graphics done by hand thing was a thing in Hacker Adventure 1, and of course, unsurprisingly, it's still happening here. die instantly to that one bomb? How much health did I have? Does that thing kill you in one hit? Okay, it took three off. Maybe I had like, maybe I wasn't fully healed the first time around playing this or something like that, I don't know. Okay, we got by it, there we go. I get through there though. Oh, they're grab. Uh oh. Oh, I have to go back a bit. I thought there may be like some sort of firepower you need to melt those ice blocks, but they're grab blocks. Oops. <laughs> Now this has one exit again. Oh my god, it's these platforms. That I don't even know how the hell they work, and this one is just stuck in... Okay, this platform just got stuck in place, somehow. This platform just got stuck in place, and this is just gonna jitter like that forever. I don't even go with these platforms. Give me a break. I had a feeling someone would be up there if you could just... I knew someone would be up there. It's just a bunch of coins, really? Considering I've already got this many lives, it doesn't make much of a difference. I'm really not good with these platforms. So let me get the hang of this one. Because more novelty will just be sent flying at ridiculous speeds. So we have we are on a three block wide moving platform and there's a bullet bill generator This game has knockback Okay, this is just a disaster in the making It's like one hit deaths all over again unless you're really good and know which way you're gonna get flung and can react fast enough can't afford to let any of these hit you. You'll just die because of knockback. So that health bar up there doesn't really do anything. It's as if you may not even have a- it's as if you don't even need a life bar for this part. Might as well not even have a life bar here. You're just gonna get killed in one hit because you get knocked off the platform and can't recover. Come on, I hope this ends soon. Oh, good. Oh, there we go. Might as well not even have a life bar for sections like that. So 
Where's the platform? Where's the platform? Oh, there it is. Midpoint. How fast is this platform gonna go? The level isn't really entirely centered around these platforms. I thought it was going to be for a second there. I thought the level's gonna be centered only around these platforms. You're gonna have to know how to make the jumps or you're screwed. At least there's no bullet build generator here, so that makes things easier. In fact, there's no bullet build generator, so you could just get hit by one of them and that'll be it. How fast is this platform gonna go? Yeah, how do you expect me to... Oh, I just did it. <laughs> okay, that was just pure luck right there. I did not think I would be landing on that platform. You'll have to watch that again and see how lucky that was. Okay, what level is this? Okay, now this beach is made of ice. We got Cherno's theme playing. In the yeah. The ice beach. Sure, why not? And these are blocks you can melt, right? enemies in some of these. This is just like Super Mario Brothers 3. Wait, what's the point of going there? Or some of the blocks have, like, punchers in them. That's just like Super Mario Brothers 3. I'm really surprised I don't see that more often. Usually when you see it, it's a Japanese hack that you see it in, strangely enough. Like, I don't know. I don't know why it's the Japanese people do it. Fire flower to get through this level. Why could I be given a fire flower? I mean, if it's a requirement, then it should be given to you, or at least known. Right? Get away! Get away, Chucky! <sighs> ah, that's the ending. Oh, we're almost done this world, believe it or not. Sonic music, again! Kisume's on parachutes. Sure, why not? Ahead out. We only get the head of Marissa. I was like, what the hell? <laughs>